Okay, so you should have made a cube. Uh, and the next step in your project is to learn how to put a hole in the cube. There are a number of ways to do this, um, but I'm going to show you hopefully the simplest one. So we have our cube in front of us and we need to make an additional sketch. So we're going to go up, select sketch. We need to tell the computer where we're going to sketch on and we're going to sketch on the cube. Click on the cube and now I want you to make a circle. So we hover over the little drop down arrow. We're going to choose a center point circle. Click on it. Go down to your cube. Probably near the center. Click. Drag. Click again. We have our circle. Let's accept the circle by clicking on the check mark. Now, in order to make a hole, we need to go back to the extrusion tool. So, click on extrude. Go down here and tell it where we're going to extrude, which is we're going to extrude that circle. Click on it so it's highlighted. Now, you should see this drop down menu and we're going to focus on this choice of remove. When you extrude and choose remove, you are removing material from your existing part. So click on remove. And there's one more uh, selection we need to make, which is down here to this drop down menu where currently it says blind. But I'm going to click on it and go all the way to the bottom and choose through all. You can see there are a bunch of choices and they're kind of self-explanatory uh, and you're just going to choose the thing or the selection that would work for whatever you're actually trying to do. But if we want to put a hole all the way through something, we pick through all. Click. You can see that the shape already looks as though it's hollow and so we're going to click on the check mark. And if you did it correctly, you now have a cube with a hole in it. That's it.